I always had this idea that I would like to work for myself and be more creative in what I did rather than just producing designs that were created by somebody else. The biggest decision I had to make at that time was to leave a very well-paid job and set out on my own, which was probably way back at that time unheard of of the people that would have left Waterford Crystal. It's Misha Eamon Thrian, Master Garahor Crystal, Y Crystal Arena on Rhine. So the history of glass goes back centuries really in water. It just seems that the people in this area took to crystal design and crystal making with their ease. There's something beautiful about crystal in the way it catches its light. And every design that you'll put on a piece of crystal reacts differently. But I think that when you're holding a piece of crystal in your hand and you get that feel, that you can feel the design, that it's not mass produced, you can feel the sharpness of the cuts and that somebody has painstakingly spent a lot of time creating that object. It's not just a product, it has a story attached to it. They're all based on our landscape, our history and our culture. It's been an interesting journey since I left Waterford Crystal, I suppose. Uh, a lot has happened uh, since then. Uh, technology has changed a lot. People's perception of crystal has changed as well. Younger people now, we are trying to make it exciting for them that they will own crystal again. But I've been doing this for over 40 years now. So that's a lot of experience in crystal design and crystal cutting. I'm still learning every day new ways to do things. I'm probably at my happiest when I'm working on the wheel with just a piece of crystal. I don't consider what I do as a job. I don't look at the clock and wondering is it five o'clock and time to go home. But every time that I do something here and somebody sees what I do, it's uh, keeping the art and craft alive. If you have something that you believe in and that you're able to do, you should always follow your dream. Most people that work for themselves don't think of retiring. While I'll continue to enjoy what I do, I will keep doing it. They'll probably be taken out of here legs first. <laughs>